everyone. Welcome back. The party plan on the train. Oh, for my birthday, my little brother, by the way, I love you, bro. Thank you for it. Uh, he gave me a $25 gift card, a second of charge. How beautiful. Okay, I'm back. Sybil, you're beautiful. Thank you. Okay, so I got three movies. Now, I got them all in new packaging because I have movies at home that I have to watch. And I didn't want to buy something and then not watch it for a little while and then it be broken and be lost money because they have a two week return deadline. So I got three movies all in the new packaging. I still got like over $2 left on my gift card. I got Jarhead, The Fighter. I love both of these actors, Krista Bell, Mark Wahlberg. And I got The Silence of the Lambs. I've already seen this, but I love this movie. So I got this because it's new and it's awesome. And also because Sybil is beautiful. Nude. Hey, Sybil. She puts the lotion in the basket. Ew. She puts the lotion in the basket. She put the lotion in the basket. You work it, girls. Merry Christmas, everyone. Even though it is October. Merry Christmas to you anyways. Okay, not gonna lie, I'm in Kohl's and they always have Christmas stuff in here, so I guess I shouldn't complain. People do the thing. <laughs> Hold it again. How cool is that? Hey, Griswold, where do you think you're gonna put a tree that big? Bend over and I'll show you. Haha. <laughs> I am definitely reviewing that movie during the holidays. I can't believe that some people actually don't like the Polar Express. It boggles my mind that some people don't like the Polar Express. It's such a great movie. I saw it in IMAX three times for three field trips when I was in elementary school. I have no idea why. Yeah, they took me on the same field trip in three different grades in elementary school. I got no clue why, but I saw an IMAX 3D three times as a kid. I also watched it in class with Hot Choco one time. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Yeah, I don't know why they made me watch it so much when I was a kid. <laughs> it was weird. Hey, uh, so I want to talk y'all a little bit about, okay, so my birthday was recently, I don't, I'm pretty sure I told y'all that, and my older brother, he got me this book, it's called The Movie Book, pretty interesting read, um, most of the books in this, that they talk about in this movie are really old, which is kind of disappointing, because I can't relate to a lot of the movies in here, but, um, I learned a lot about, like, early films, um, like A Trip to the Moon, for example, was, like, the first movie it was like 13 minutes long i watched it on youtube after reading about it in this um yeah pretty good read um also baby yoda's back there and we're going to a pumpkin patch today and we're going to take him with us so that should be fun it's very uh, apparent when flipping through this book that the author of this book really likes black and white movies um oh there's an anime movie in here <laughs> that's kind of cool i don't watch anime but Yeah, there's like, I've never heard of like so many of the movies in here. Like I was expecting like movies like Collateral and stuff like that that I would be more familiar with. But I mean, hey, they got Pulp Fiction. And there's a page about Jaws in here. So that's pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, there's like a lot of movies in here that are like from the 50s and 60s. Oh, hey, I found Blade Runner. Yeah. So there's some stuff in here I recognize. But yeah, I'm learning a lot about movies that I... um. I never heard of because they're so old. So there's Taxi Driver, Star Wars, Alien. Yeah, so, I mean, there's some stuff in here I know, but there's, like, a lot of, like, really old movies in here. But, yeah, this is a pretty interesting book. Um, yeah, really cool gift. Okay, so we just came out of Walmart. Uh, they were selling Assassin's Creed on 4K for 20 bucks. That's expensive. Well, I mean, I know that it was on 4K, but Assassin's Creed. Well, you think the movie's bad. Is it's that so I... bad. I saw that old... It's so bad. I saw this old video game called Bully. 
everybody used to play it. Yes, I remember that. I remember Dashi and PewDiePie playing that. Yeah, I saw it had one that was for Xbox One and Xbox 360, and they came out with like a edition, a special edition. So anyway, I got a few movies in there with my birthday money. The first thing I got was The Shining, Jack Nicholson, greatest actor to ever walk the earth. I got both of the Kill Bill movies. And I got Days of Thunder, Tom Cruise, one of my all-time favorite actors. Ben. Break, Ben. So we're not going to the pumpkin patch anymore, but we're going to get there. And we're going to take baby Yoda. So right now, Sybil and I are in the middle of watching Stranger Than You Think with Will Ferrell. It's all right so far. Stranger Than Fiction, I meant, sorry. <laughs> Who? Who would buy this? I'm not gonna call them anything but the Redskins because I hate that they changed their name. So it just came out of Target. Civil looks pretty, as always. And I bought this. I saw parts of this on TV once, but I never watched the whole thing through. Best Buy, here we come! We're here! Best Buy is communism. What? There's never anything. They're moving everything online. Well, so what? Is the whole store gonna dissolve and go online? That's the cars. CDs and movies. The CDs and movies. Well, so it's just gonna be nothing but TVs now? And phone chargers and stuff? And refrigerators and gaming stuff and. Well, then what's the point going to Best Buy anymore? Okay, well, I think that's gonna about do it for me. Um, yeah, I pretty much vlogged my entire day. Um, yeah, it's been a long day. Spent a lot of money, but got a lot of movies out of it. That's pretty great. Um, and I'm gonna buy new, more movies uh, here before too long, because I still got some birthday money left over. Uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Subscribe to Pod Player Entertainment for more. Hit the like button. Leave movie review suggestions down in the comments down below. Follow me on Instagram at Potted Planner Entertainment for channel updates. And uh, much love. Bye.